Good morning, or almost afternoon or evening, wherever you are. This is for you, Don Johnson. When are you going to apologize for your three years in which you were right by Dutch's side being his pit bull? Hmm? Quit your crying. Own up to your role. And you can send a million emails to Dutch. God himself could send an email to Dutch. He ain't going to tell you shit. You, of all people, should know that. Weren't you his, his right-hand gal? I mean, you sure as hell were his pit bull. So let's take our focus off of Dutch for a moment and acknowledge your role. Isn't Karma a little cunt? Yes, because she's come looking for you and she's paying you back. You see... For almost four years now, you have been by Dutch's side, screaming his praises. And to this day, because you said it yourself in one of your own comments on one of your own videos recently, that you still believe in earthquake forecasting and your chart. You do know that your chart is based on incorrect data, correct? Do you not get that? It is based on a lie. Therefore, you are no better than Dutch. Half of the victims you're crying to are the ones you helped make victims. Do you people realize that? That while she sits there and and screams, oh, Dutch did this, and he said that, and he did this to Rebecca and Annie, and blah, blah, blah. You do realize that the one you're listening to is also one of those who victimized you? It's not even been three months, honey. The body's not even cold. It hasn't even hit the first stages of decomposition, and you're crying victimhood? And you're crying over thirty-one fifty? Really? You get that monster two fifty? What the hell wrong with you, woman? How many times I got to tell you don't get that man no two fifty? South Park. Thanks, guys. Giving that monster two fifty. You gave him a buck fifty. What the fuck for? A lie? But you know what? Part of me says. Those who were victimized, it serves you right because you were warned so many times. But did you learn a lesson? That's where it matters. To me, that's where it matters. I think that's where it matters to God, to karma, that you realize your mistake, you learned from it, and you didn't repeat it, and you sure as hell didn't do it to anyone else. Now, Don, you may not be asking for money. You are losing subscribers. Because I've seen your numbers go from 836 or so down to 773 now. And I never was one of them. And I never will be one of them. That just doesn't mean that I can't see your videos. Annie G. You were so happy. When you were in that room with all your friends, Bella included. And then something happened or something didn't happen. Words got said. You didn't like it. And yet, you're still sitting there on the wrong team. When will you learn? I love it how victims just love to be victimized. Are you Democrat by any chance? It wouldn't surprise me. Maybe you're pulling out your black card. Candace Owens speaks of that so fondly. Doesn't matter what color you are. The point is, is that you all play victim when some of you are actually the offender. 
because you were just so fine preaching all the words about Dutch and the miracles and the lives he saved. He didn't save no goddamn lives. If anything, he's ruined them. I wonder how many people that used to follow Dutch that gave money have passed away. And now they know the truth because they're wherever they're at. Because now they know better. Now they see what it's really for. Now they see the trees through the forest. So Dawn, quit your crying, quit your whining, and own up. Quit being a little lying cunt of a woman. Own up to your role of almost four years of the damage you did alongside Dutch. And you too, Rebecca. I don't care what the hell you've got. Life's a bitch, isn't it? Well, she's come to visit you. Her name is Karma. Did I tell you that I carry a, a, a public rep card? Oh, no, I didn't. I'm pretty sure I mentioned it at one time or another. I mean, not 90 days ago. Were you by his side? Helping his scam. Everything was hunky-dory. Oh, until he said a few words. What are you, in high school? Woman, you already got a reputation of a nut job. Oh, now I'm talking to Rebecca about the nut job part. Huh, well, I might as well be talking to both of you. You've already got the reputation of a nut job, pit bull, psychopath. Not just because of who you followed, but because of the things you personally said out of your mouth and out of your fingers on the keyboard, being that keyboard warrior you are, to people. That the moment they even disagreed with you, you lashed out and your venom spewed everywhere. Well, swallow my venom, bitch. Own up to your part apologize and I'm going to watch your numbers drop more until you're an insignificant memory because you're just as bad as Dutch even if you don't ask for money what's worse is you ask people to believe you you're all a lot of lizards whoring out that's right, I called you a lot lizard. I called you a cocksucker. You're an idiot. You're a waste of time. And you're just as guilty as Dutch.